Hello everyone, today I'm gonna be talking about my current setup which is in this corner. I call it corner of pain. This is because of my turbo trainer here. Oh by the way, it's Wahoo Kicker Core, well known model. I am happy owner of this since three years. And it's a very robust, reliable, reliable and tough device. I think it's more tougher than Russian tanks, although it's not perfect. Uh, speaking about Canyon, uh, I think it's a temporary solution for now because I'm going to buy a separate bike that will be dedicated for doing workouts indoor. But because I haven't anything, I am using this Canyon. Uh, because cyclocross uh, season is going to, to 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 the end so yeah it's coming to the end so uh yeah I, I installed this bike on my turbo trainer and for the past couple of months I was riding on 40 millimeter continental terra speed tubeless ready tires of course uh sealed with sealant and I have to say it's amazing product uh so yeah, uh, what else we have here apart from the mess? Two pair of shoes, two SPD, typical, and two road shoes. Uh, I'm going to make some fixes to those shoes because they have uh, they they are five years old, even more than five years. So I need to do some repairs. A uh, lot of tools. Pump. A lot of screws. And here on the right is BMC Team Machine SLR 2 from 2016. And what's interesting, it's rim brakes. Rim brakes, bro. Yeah, I think in decades from now, riding rim brake bikes will be will be a new cool. <laughs> but now it's more like, oh, why are you still riding rim brakes? They are disc brakes bikes. So I like disc brakes. I have nothing up, up against disc brakes. Uh, I know the reasons why the bike industry is gravitating towards disc brakes and they want to uniform all kinds of bikes with regards to the braking system especially because they can design wheels in isolation from the braking there is no uh, no longer considerations like uh, heat dissipation when braking uh, the braking surface uh, durability something like this which is not connected directly with the fact what we expect from the wheel when it is rolling so yeah uh, i know i know it although i can agree that uh, rim brakes is well proven technology it's very very good system and in case of road bikes there is no uh no usability reason i would say to go with disc brakes but yeah i understand the producers uh okay so here in this uh bmc we have pretty pretty light uh mavic uh, mavic Xerion wheels they are aluminium pair of those wheels weighs around one kilogram and a half so it's very good to very good result uh, if we speak about aluminium wheels. Uh, Giant TCR Advanced is uh, my third baby, the newest one. Uh, full electronic group set, as you already know. Uh, it's the lightest bike in my collection, um, about 6.7 kilograms. So I would say climbing machine. All right, uh, I think it's all. 
some books, some bottles. Oh, and here we have two helmets. This one I'm not using anymore because you are getting very hot on overcast day riding in black uh, helmet, but this one I'm using on for time trials. Uh, and I have the third one, which is Bontrago Race Cell that I'm using like almost every time I go outside for road bike. Mm. Okay, have a nice weekend, bye.